Yeah, I'm not yeah. Kupidia, Wasafi FM. Yeah. Tuko na Mr. Meke 1997. Yeah. Miss Tanzania Top 10 1998. Yeah. Uh, Mnet Face of Africa 1998 Top 5. Elite uh, Model Look Tanzania Top 17 1999. <laughs> Miss, Earth, uh, Miss Earth Tanzania oh. 2008 First Runner Up. Miriam hey. Odemba. Uh, and she looks like she's what? 17. I mean, wow. Wow. Oh, what an wow. introduction. Thank you. Are you coming out? You know, you look so young like she's wow. glowing she is definitely glowing wow thank you guys thank you thank you karibu sana block 89 miriam karibu sana kwenye block 89 once That's again fancy. you understand ni kwa mara ya kwanza tumekuwa blessed uh, amefika hapa you understand kwa hiyo kama uko na swala ambayo unahitaji kumuuliza ni Instagram tunatumia Wasafi FM pamoja na Wasafi TV. Uh, ukiweka comment yako kwenye YouTube, yeah. Mwamba Kachilo Ndiso anataiona pale, si ndio? Oh. Alafu tunaishi hivyo. Ni Miss wa kwanza kuwa kwenye block 89. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Miss and model wa kwanza oh, oh. kwenye block 89. Top Tanzanian international model. I mean, you know. Oh, yeah. <laughs> it's my it's my pleasure to be here in Wasafi TV. TV yeah. as Miriam Modemba and uh, yeah, nashukuru sana kwa Kar- the invitation and yeah, yeah. Nafanya kazi nzuri sana wasafi. Thank, Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Unagonga meza kimisi. Ongeri sana. Um, kipindi ambacho ya nilvanza urembo and uh, tulikuwa tunaizi support. Kiki mingi. Yeah, so see, yeah, mini misi ambaye nimetolewa na magazeti. It was hard for me to, you know, grow. Yeah, to grow. Lakini nimetoka sabu ya ni ya wananchi magazeti and and uh, Gina Miriam Odemba sio kama <laughs> vipindi wa sasa hivi yani yeah, yeah. yeah so yeah na shukuru Mungu naendelea and uh, nice. na um, yeah na support sana pia for the young girls yeah 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 so Karibu sana, karibu sana kwenye block 89. Lakini kabla tujiendelea mimi nataka nifahamu. I know kwamba wewe ni I know utakuwa una bills nyingi sana ambazo unakuwaaga unalipa kwenye your daily life. Sijui unaelewa, kuna bills za nyumba labda, eh? yeah. za hospital, yeah. kuna bills za chakula, za umeme, za magari, mali, magari biashara and stuff like that. Ikitokea kwamba kuna bill moja inabidi usamehewe, usio unailipa. Itakuwa ni bill gani? Kwa hapa Tanzania au kwa Paris? <laughs> kote, 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 kote. Yeah. Kwa sisi hapa naishi Paris. Yes. So um bili kusamewa, bili ya nyumba. <laughs> yeah. Is it? Yeah. Okay. Bili ya majengo, you know. Mm. So yeah. Uh, Miriam mm. you're in Paris lakini vile vile uh, kuna hii Miriam Odemba Foundation kwa mtu ambaye hajawahi kuisikia wala hajawahi kujua ni kitu gani na uhusiana na nini and uh, goals and plans za 2019 ni zipi kwa ajili ya hii foundation Wow swali zuri sana Miriam Odemba Foundation ni foundation ambayo is about education for the young children for the young generation and uh, kwa sababu yani as Miriam Odemba as mimi nimeanza umodo nilivyokuwa mdogo sana nimeanza umodo na miaka 14 sijui nani nyinyi yeah. mlikuwa mko shule so mm-hmm. ndio maana every day um, wa Tanzania mnakuwa mnaujiuliza kwa nini Miriam Odemba zeki yeah. so the thing is hiyo ndio siri yangu kwa sababu nimeanza uh, wana mitindo nilikuwa mdogo sana na nilikuwa napenda na pia nimetoka kwenye familia duni mm-hmm. so wazazi wangu wakunipeleka shule yani elimu ya secondary sikupata yeah. so yani I, I was supposed to struggle myself you know to take myself to school and uh, yeah so ndio maana nimefungua foundation yangu kusaidia watoto kupata elimu kwa sababu elimu ni ufunguo wa maisha kwa mm-hmm. Kiswahili wanasema yeah. yes. wazazi wetu wanasema so kitu ambacho i miss katika maisha yangu mm-hmm. it was like i wish yani ningekuwa na elimu university na you know yeah. so this kind of thing is like um i don't want to let my daughter to have the same problem you know so yeah. nika decide mimi siku elimu kubwa so ni bora nifungue my foundation mm-hmm. itaweza kuwasaidia watoto wa Tanzania kupata elimu 
Yeah. So ndo maana nimefungua Miriam Odinga Foundation. Yeah. Anavosema miaka 18 alianza modeling, <laughs> miaka 14 alikuwa ni Miss Atemeke 1997 at a very young age. Lakini yeah. kibongo bongo changamoto kubwa ni kwamba wazazi hatuamini, hawaamini ndoto za watoto zao. And wewe ulishinda kinyang'anyiro hicho at a very young age and you kept pushing, pushing, pushing mpaka leo hii Tanzania ukisema moja kati ya watu ambao tuko proud nao kwa nao ni Miriam Odemba. Mm-hmm. Uh, struggles zote changamoto yoyote when ulipomwambia baba na mama kwamba I want to try kufanya hiki kitu. Um, nilipomwambia mama mama alikubali wow. lakini babangu alikata I love your mom Yeah <laughs> Um mama yeah, alikata and uh, mm. yes akasema oh Miriam yani unaanza yani umisi natakiwa ukae nyumbani when msichana so I take you yani u unani ufanye umis yeah. lakini nilipomwambia tu mama mama akasema yeah why not itatusaidia so mamangu alinipa support sana lakini babangu alikata i want us to play a game na kutajia miaka alafu kwa sababu you also smart lady mimi najua utakao unajua utanitajia ni miss gani alishinda mwaka gani so you can do that majina kumi tu haraka haraka nani <laughs> majina tu ama miss ambao wamewahi kupita kwenye category mbalimbali mbali. kwenye hapa Tanzania mm-hmm. so tunaanza moja kwa moja F1996 Tisina sita. Oh my. Um Aina Maeda? No, Shonse. Shinari. Yeah. Oh. Ah. <laughs> Elfu 1998. Tisina nane. Tisina nane. Nancy Smari? Basila Monukuzi. Basila Monukuzi. <laughs> oh my god. Elfu 1999. Tisina tisa. Tisina tisa. Mm. Oh my She's god. She's famous. Oh. She's very famous. You know her. Mm, She's a journalist sasa hivi. Oh, Betty. Oistemo. Oistemo. Oh. Ah, <laughs> mbili, mwaka 2000. Oh I'm sure she's your friend. Mwaka 2000. Oh, Au Jack mchabali. Hiyo si kusahau, hiyo si wetu. 2001. Nice. 2001, Sparrow Jacket. Moda umenzio. Happiness na guess. Oh, happiness. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> uh, elf mbili na tano. F2 na tano. Oh, Apu. I'm not into miss. F2 na sita. F2 na sita. Oh no. I I even know. No, 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 no. Where my step to? Where my step? Oh. <laughs> so, una una. F2 na hii ya mwisho. F2 na 18. Na F2 na 18. Na oh, nimemsahau jina. Oh my god, I'm sorry guys. <laughs> Queen Elizabeth Makune. Oh, uh, thank you. I'm sorry. It's okay. Uh, <laughs> ukiangalia industry ya Urembo Tanzania, uh, toko lilipotoka mpaka lilipofikia. Mm. How proud are you na uko disappointed kiasi gani? I'm very proud kwa sababu uh, nimekuwa chachu kwa wasichana wadogo mm-hmm. na ambapo yani um, nimeanza like I said yeah, nimeanza nilipokuwa mtoto. So yani I'm um uh, mi, mimi ni kama ex- Inspiration. Dio. Mm. <laughs> I'm a yeah. Yeah. Yes. Yes. And, uh, and I'm a legendary as well. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> so um wa, wasichana mm-hmm. wadogo wanapenda kuwa kama mimi. Kweli. Alafu um kitu gani kingine? Tuseme chochote, chochote Miriam Odemba na chokigusa. Mpaka sasa hivi nilipo. Ndio. Ya. Yeah? Nikibadilisha style yenyewe leo ni yake nyeusi mm. watu wataiga. Nimeka um, blonde. Mm. Uh-huh. Everybody. Everybody copy my style. Those are style going to Miriam Odemba. Mnaikumbuka? Yeah. So, yeah. yeah. So chochote Miriam Odemba na chogusa yani nashukuru Mwenyezi Mungu. Yaani I keep inspired people they still you know appreciate what I'm doing. Yes. So that's Kaza. something good for me. That's yeah. very nice. Yeah. Oh, ndio. Ndio. Eh mzee. Sasa. Sisi tuna flyer sana eh kwa sababu ana 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 inspire vijana wengine. Eh sasa anakaa Ufaransa kama alivyotuambia uh-huh. na alipoulizwa masuala ya kodi uh-huh. akasema kwamba kitu kama ni cha kupungua basi iwe kodi ya nyumba uh-huh. e, na kuna familia kule e, kuna familia kule <laughs> na mtoto yuko na kuna mtoto kule uh-huh. na ajazana mtanzania tukumbuke <laughs> na amezaa na Mfaransa sasa uh-huh. sisi wa Tanzania kuna kitu tunajisikia hapo uh-huh. tunajua ni nini lakini <laughs> inakireketa kinatukuereketa kweli sasa <laughs> Tunataka tujue kwa sababu gani alizaa na Mfaransa na pia hata size ukimsikia maneno yake kama ma, Kiswahili ana kama anakizumu ni kwa sababu amekaa sana au yule Mfaransa ndo anataka amuibe vipi mama Iris anaitwa <laughs> 
Iris. Iris. Mama Iris. I love kuna wengine wananiitia mtoto wangu mama Iris. So. So guys, please no, mind the gap over there. Please anaitwa <laughs> Iris. I love mama Iris kwa Kifaransa ni uwa. Oh. Wow. And uh, kwa Kiswahili ni mboni. So no, bora mnitie no. mtoto wangu mponi kushinda Iris. Oh, no. <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah. So yeah, uh, kusu mume wangu, baba watoto wangu um naishi nayo Ufaransa. Mm-hmm. Yeah, kwa nini nimemchagua? Kwa sababu nilikuwa um nilivoshiriki mashindano yangu ya Emirates Face of Africa, nikashinda lakini nilipotezewa um bosi wangu Okay. Mm. Bosi wangu Maremo Amina Mongi. Okay. Yeah, yeye ndo alikuwa ni alifariki. Yeah. So, yeah. alipofariki Amina Mongi, nilikuwa yani um, nilipata pigo kubwa sana kwa sababu yeye yeah. ndo alikuwa ananifanyia kila kitu. Ana arrange all my meetings, um, kazi zangu. True. So, hicho kitu kiliniuma sana. Bosi wangu alivosafiri na nilikuwa na ndrama sana na vyombo vya habari mm. Tanzania. Yani mm. nilikuwa ni kama yani um, Miriam Odemba um kipindi iko nilikuwa kama nani princess diana wewe yani nilikuwa yani nafuatwa yani everywhere kwa sababu yani nilikuwa nime um contract yangu ilikuwa ime um ime canceliwa with a little model look of the year for two years contract kwa sababu nilikuwa homesick nilienda america nilipata contract ya 100,000 USD Okay. Yeah, so miaka miwili nikafanya kazi mwaka mmoja, so nilipata nani hiyo message kama marema amina mungu amefariki. So nikaanza yani kuwa homesick, nikawa depressed, nilikuwa mdogo, nilikuwa sielewi kitu gani cha kufanya. So nikaamua kurudi Tanzania, walinirudisha kwa sababu I was very depressed, nilinenepa. Okay. <laughs> yes, nilinenepa so aka cancel my contract. Wakanambia no inabidi yani urudi Tanzania, ukapumzike, ukajipunguze na vitu kama hivyo. Okay. So nilivorudi Tanzania ilikuwa yani ni pigo kubwa waandishi wa habari ndo walikaa sawa wamepata like tension, tension. Uh, Miriam mm. Odemba is like everywhere nikienda yani same yoyote napigwa picha Yo. yani na na camera it's everything wow. yani na magazeti nzizo kulikuwa mna Instagram mna Facebook ya yeah, yani ni magazeti yani asubuhi ukiamka yeah. Odemba Okay, I mean, yani it's like I was homesick. Yeah, yani nilikuwa yeah. najificha yani kasema nitafanyaje kwa sababu yani ah no. Yani ninge, nikapata idea nikasema okay wazazi wangu wakanambia bora Miriam usafiri kwa sababu ukikaa hapa utachanganyikiwa unaweza yani ku yani hata uka nani uka ugo depression mm. yeah, uka ugo so, depression hivi tuna tunamjibu vipi mtu ambaye na anakusikiza sasa hivi lakini anakuangalia alafu anajiuliza uh, Miriam ni ukutiziwa gani anaondokaga sasa hivi yeah. anajiuliza kwamba yupo bongo anafanya nini mm-hmm. tunaweza tukamjibu vipi huyu oh sasa hivi nimekuja kwa sababu si nime na foundation yangu foundation okay. yangu nimeifungua um, Paris. Okay. Yeah, I just launched my foundation in Paris. Na sasa hivi so nimekuja kutoa misaada. Okay. Yeah. 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 Ebu gonga hey. Ebu hey. Yeah. Hey. Kuna kuonga mesa yeah. 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 kama hiyo. <laughs> so nataka niongee na mheshimiwa Joket. Anambia yeah. shule gani naweza kwenda kutoa misaada yangu. Uh-huh. Na nitaendelea ni kusaidia mashule. Hiyo ndio kazi yangu sasa. That is very nice. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Alikutana na Kanye. Alikutana na Kim pia huyo. Zito ba. Kanye West bwana alikutana nao mimi walizungumza nini sijui hata kina Kim Kardashian bwana sijui mlizungumza nini au ulitunadi vipi au walikuulizia nini kuhusu Tanzania hebu tupe ka story kidogo cha Kim na Kanye oh Kanye West Kanye West Kanye West Kanye West Kanye West ni kutana na Paris kwenye fashion show sababu yeye anakuwa anaenda kwenye fashion show kwa sababu ya model in Paris I work with Urban Model yeah. Agency. Yeah. Then nikaalikuwa kwenye fashion week and uh, nilivalikuwa kwenye fashion week nikakutana na Kanye Kanye akaniona uh, akapendezwa na mimi ya yeah, top model yule nini Mira Modemba wow. akanita ya yeah, well, let's come and dance na nini akasema okay mimi yeah. napenda sana kucheza. Jamaa yeah. iko fresh tu ana noma yule. Mm. Bwana jeuri sana kwa mimi. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, na alipendezewa na mimi na nilikuwa na rafiki yeah. yangu mmoja anaitwa Rosemary Kokilwa ambaye ni stylist. 
Yeah, and I'm saying, yeah, guess I'm a Flavian Matata, Convalisha and stuff like. Speaking of stylists, keep on going. Wait, Koyo Abu Kokanya, Koyo and Akanyam Lishia, Wapi, and Lishia Kucheza, then that's it. Kucheza. Wait to bring a bill to care and put a deals. Wow, come on. Kama, ni pata kazi. Ni pata kazi alinipa connection, alinitambulisha kwa Naomi Campbell. Yes. Yes. Wow. yes. Yeah. So Campbell. Na eh, Campbell. Naomi Campbell. Yeah. Naomi Campbell. Yeah, na yeah, Naomi Campbell. So alinitambulisha kwake. Na kuna siku nilikuwa America, so nikakutana tena na Naomi na yeah, what kama yani nikikutana nao they are like who in Tanzania? Mm. Diamond. No, Labda, yeah, they come and say hello to me. Yeah. Yeah. Really? Exactly. exactly. Yeah. I would like to know. Uh, in Amali, for Nico Faransa, yeah? Uh, yeah. Mm. No, in Dio. Paris. Yeah. Paris. Yeah. You know, Faransa to Kuzambuli. Yeah. 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 Paris, you know. Yeah. 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 Were you part of the people who were in Saidia Damon who had connections in Afali? Because you're a big deal and you're exposed and stuff like that. Amali, you guys never met. Wakati Nama and Afanika? Ah uh, inaya uh, ah salam alintafuta <laughs> salam yeah salam wewe wewe ndo salam jamaa salim salim, <laughs> salim. Yeah. salim. <laughs> uh-huh. alintafuta kanambia diamond yuko uh, paris lakini nilikuwa niko kikazi streets kwa sababu nafanya kazi streets nime ni mimi ni model pia na uh, nimesainiwa na visage modeling agency okay. in switzerland so aliponipigia nilikuwa swiss so sikupata muda wa kwenda kuonana na na ni na salem pia um fali fali is like my best friend so Aww. yeah nice yes i na no mimi nafikiri bango ni bango ni hatari wewe inabidi tumpe mira modemba pia nafasi ya kuongea na mashabiki wake kwa sababu time yetu kidogo ukimwangalia mira modemba ni mwanamke ambaye yuko very natural yani ngozi nywele thank you makeup nimepaka mimi makeup ni muhimu Mimi ni tengeneze sijaenda leo kupakaliwa because I was wasichana ambao wanakuwa hawajiamini wao kama wao kwamba inafika mahali mtu kwamba I would rather do surgery ina mean niwe hivi niongeze kitu fulani kwenye mwili wangu niongeze hiki nipunguze hiki unamshauri nini sasa hivi Um wanawake yani kwa Tanzania yani sasa hivi nilivyoangalia mm-hmm. kitu cha kwanza Tanzania mm-hmm. wanapenda sana mafuta mazuri mafuta mm-hmm. mkorogo Ni sema wanapenda mafuta mazuri iwe mkorogo iwe natural skin care uwe brown skin care yeah. uwe miria <laughs> uwe miria modemba color uh-huh. so yani um mimi as a Miriam Odemba yeah. napenda sana mafuta mazuri. So ningependa ni kuambia wasichana wa Tanzania nitawaletea mafuta one day. Okay. I will open my company. Mm, yeah. yeah, mafuta yangu Odemba, kwa sababu um, um, black skin yeah kama yani skin yangu ya yani my skin watu wengi ngozi nyeusi ngozi <laughs> nyeusi mm. watu wengi wanakuwa yani wana, wanapenda ngozi nyeusi kuna modo mkubwa sana ana yani analipwa sana um, ametoka Sudan huyo modo mm-hmm. ana rangi nyeusi nyeusi yeah. nyeusi unaona yani wa, ame toka yani amepewa yeye kuwa is like a black baby. Yeah. So mm. sisi wa Tanzania wengi wetu wa Tanzania tunapenda kuharibu rangi. Mm-hmm. Sio tu wa Tanzania. Wengi mm-hmm. wa Tanzania we. Naona hata sikuizi hata makaka maybe. Yeah. <laughs> yes. Hata makaka bana. A makaka wanataka ile pigile. So the thing is yani inabidi tujipende. Yani tujipende kwa sababu kama mimi sijajaribu rangi yangu. Sipakai yani cream ambayo nitaweza kuwa light mm. na paka yeah. yani cream ambayo itaweza kuni um, kufanya, kufanya ngozi yangu iwe mm. nyororo so ningependa kuwapo shauri wa Tanzania wenzangu tujipende tupende kala yetu hata kama yani yani is like mosi kama mkaa no problem jipende jiamini mm. tujiamini yani yes. thank yeah. you very true i know mimi kupe... atubadilishi hairstyle anytime soon Ya yeah, nitakesho na balisha nitakuwa blue sasa sijui wataiga. Kusuka? No, kusuka. <laughs> Bango. <laughs> Mira mimi nikupe nafasi ya mwisho ya kuongea na mashabiki wako kitu ambacho uko unahitaji kuambia. 
unawaambiaje mashabiki wako ambao wanakufuatilia kuna ambao wanakuangalia kwenye YouTube yeah. na wanakusikiza pia kwenye radio wow niko yeah. kwenye live in YouTube yeah. 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 paka wasafi tv pia uko live wow. yeah. your love everywhere honey. everywhere my you guys which kind of surprise you did yeah. this is what yeah. we do every day all day you know kwa ni kupe nafasi ya kuongea nao naomba ah uh, afans wangu ah yeah. uh, wategemee kitu kikubwa sana kina kuja and okay. surprise na pia ningependa kuambia fans wangu watoto wakubwa wakaka wadogo yeah. tujiamini tujipende tujikubali na tuombe Mungu sana tuombe Mungu sana kwa sababu maisha sasa hivi uh, yani um, we need god yeah we need god we okay. need god tunai tunamhitaji Mwenyezi Mungu sana alafu tuache proud tuache majigambo majigambo ma, kujigamba unaona eh katika yes. maisha katika maisha asa mimi as Miriam Oden ya yeah, upande wangu najiongelea ni mimi ni, yani nimeanza kujua yani dunia nimetembea yani tuseme dunia nime kidogo sijui tunaanza kuimaliza nimeanza kuimaliza mm. so nilivyokuwa yani vile famous nilikuwa naona yes yani dunia ndo he is Kim. everything yani i am Miriam Odemba but nikaja kuona this is nothing mm-hmm. you know na eh? is nothing utu is something ukiwa na utu is everything be humble watanzania tuwe humble tusio anafiki unaona eh watanzania wengi wanakuja hey i love you girl anakumbatia yeah lakini hapo ukiondoka na aina noma time yetu kidogo bango yeah yes. <laughs> so yeah be real alafu yeah watanzania tupendane amen thank yeah, you tupendane na elimu ni kitu kikubwa sana kwa wadogo zangu elimu is like handbag unavoishika hapa ukiwa na elimu yako amna mtu atakunyang'anya that amen. is for your lifetime big amen. time yes. shukrani ziende kwa Mira Modemba kwa kufika kwenye block 8988.9 bango ni kubwa uh, you understand amekupa yale madini ambao kidogo libidi uyafahamu kwa hiyo inabidi tu pay bills kidogo alafu tunarudi tena stick around nafikiri international manager aturudi wenyewe eh, tunakuja na salam mende anaitwa salam ah oh. salam <laughs> salam e bana sawa bango ni kubwa one time stick around and this is how we do jamani mnacheka nini hapo wazee bado unapiga chabu wow umeona picha ya post 